I'm going to show you how to download and install fonts to your iPad, and then you'll be able to use those fonts in Cricut Design Space. If you don't already have the iFont app, go to the App Store and download and install that onto your iPad. I'm going to open up iFont, and you can see over on the left, I have all of my installed fonts visible so I can see which fonts are on my iPad. If I want to get more fonts, I can click on the get font over on the right here. And when I click on that, it brings up some different sources. I like Defont. It has a lot of great fonts on there. So I'm going to go to Defont and look for something. Let's just do this one. I'm going to click on download. And now this pops up and it's um, asking me to import this to iFont. So I'm importing. And now you see down on the bottom of our screen by files, it says one in a red circle. So I'm going to click on that. And here's that font that I just clicked on. And this is if I want to read all the insights on it. No, I don't want to. So I'm going to click on install. And now it's saying to go to my settings or it wants to allow it close. Okay. So now once you've done this, get out of the iPhone and go to your settings and go to profile downloads. And here's that font again. It's saying, do you really want to install that? Yep, I do. Now I got to enter my code. and install and we're installing it to my profile which is connected to um, my ipad okay so it's done so now if i go back to iFont, i should be able to go to files and i can see it says it's installed so now what i'm going to do is go to cricut design space and if I open a new project and go to text and I go under my systems fonts, um, there it is. There's that font and there it is. Well, I didn't spell that right, but you get the idea. And that's how you download, install, and use a font from a site like Defont in Cricut Design Space. Make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel. I have lots more iPad videos coming for Cricut Design Space. Thanks.